All right. Welcome to our Wednesday night LWN class uh, workshop. If this is your first time being here, thanks for being here. Uh, my name is Aaron Lehman. I'm part of the LWN leadership team and really excited to learn from Andrea Lehman tonight. Um, Andrea is my sister in love, and I think she's in Payson right now, Payson, Arizona, enjoying the cooler life. Just joking. Pine top. Pine top. Pine top. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and uh, if you're catching this live on Facebook, welcome. Uh, we invite you to register for future Wednesday night education classes. And um, I'll be sure to put the, the link to register for to, so you can join us on Zoom. Um, I'll put that in the comments on Facebook and the LWN Lifestyle Group. And those of you who are watching this on YouTube, uh, whoever invited you to watch this, this call and learn from Andrea tonight, um, reach out to them if you have questions, follow-up questions, uh, take notes as, you, as you're listening tonight. Um, I know for sure we're going to get some really amazing downloads and learn a bunch of new stuff um, and be reminded of how powerful these essential oils and products from Young Living are. So without further ado, Andrea, it's all you. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You guys, thanks for hopping on um, our Wednesday night call tonight. When we went to plan out uh, 2021 in terms of education for a lifestyle career, we said, why don't we just take the body and you know, segment it into all of the systems and then teach a class each month on a different body system. So this month it's the immune system, which makes sense with uh, kiddos going back to school. It makes sense just with the world right now, right? And everybody is hyper aware of um, their immune system and wanting stronger immune systems. And so the goal tonight is just to, um, Take take your knowledge base up just a, a, a hint more when it comes to Young Living products that you might be able to add to your arsenal to help support your immune system. So thanks for hanging with us. Um, Aaron, I'm going to have you watch both in the group, or sorry, in this in the Zoom event, but then also for comments in the lifestyle group as well. We're going to do uh, four giveaways tonight, uh, $20 product credits. And all you have to do is answer the question to be entered to win. So uh, so that's that. And then what else do I want to make sure you guys know? We posted uh, just this morning. It's interesting because this class doesn't usually land on the first day of the month. Um, so there's a lot of stuff going on uh, because it's the first. If you look in the lifestyle group, we also posted all of our um, supplements and oils and products that we wanted to feature for the month that have to do with the immune system. So you'll wanna check out that. There'll be posts throughout the month specifically on each of those products. And we do a, a couple giveaways throughout the month with that as well. So without further ado, let me pull up the PowerPoint. And of course, I don't have it at the beginning because I was looking over it. All right, here we go. The immune system. Um, and the disclaimer that we've got to give at the beginning of this is that we are not treating, diagnosing, curing anything. We're not telling you what to do with your immune system. We're just sharing Young Living products that are helpful and supportive as well as other modalities and foods and things like that. We encourage you always to be the CEO of your own health. Uh, to work with whatever practitioners you choose uh, to work with. But really, uh, it becomes powerful when you take ownership of your own health. So once again, not treating, not curing, not prescribing any diseases or anything like that. If I slip and I say any sort of disease name or anything like that, I'm going to try to be careful. Know that the oils are freaking awesome. And so you can look them up and you can see like all of the words that I'm not allowed to say. So you're going to hear me... Um, repeating a lot of the same words when I, when I'm describing them, because I, I, I need to talk in terms of support. Um, but know that there are some very specific things that some of these oils do. And so I would encourage you to check out uh, in your desk reference, if you have one, um, or to look online, uh, use PubMed. I'm going to, I'm going to talk about PubMed a couple times, asking you to go look up an oil there, because there's some pretty cool research uh, that has been done on oils uh, in pubmed.gov. Uh, so what's kind of cool about this is that my first introduction to 
the youngling was through an immune supporting oil, oil, thieves oil. I want to know in the comments, how many of you have already used thieves essential oil for immune support? And if you have a cool story related to it, and you want to throw that in the chat, go right ahead. It's your story. You can share it. So for me, this was 14, over 14 years ago now, almost 15 years ago when my mother-in-law gave us oils in our stocking for Christmas and I knew nothing about them. I thought it was like bath and body work stuff. And so I put them up in the medicine cabinet. They stayed there for a while. Luckily she kept telling me to try the thieves that she'd given us because I was a school teacher and my immune system was really shy. I was picking up everything that would come through the classroom. I now know a lot of the reasons why my immune system was shot. Um, when I looked at my overall diet um, and things like that, there were, there were definitely things contributing to the low immune system. But anyway, I tried the thieves oil the first time. I just rubbed a few drops on my glands when I started to feel like I was coming down with something. And I woke up the next morning and I felt good. And I couldn't believe it. Like, there's no way that this oil really worked. So I thought I wasn't really getting sick. Happened again, month or two later, same symptoms that I was experiencing, scratchy throat, body feeling off. I did the same thing. I woke up the next morning and I felt good again. So this went on and on. And to the point where guys, I was before the oils, I was taking a day off work every month or two. And for the next seven years, I only had to take two days off. So that was huge. And so once this worked for me, I was like, what is this stuff? Why is this working so well? And why isn't everybody using these? And so that kind of started our journey with um, sharing these products a little bit with, with other people. And then it became more a, a, a serious business, probably four or five years in that. Um, but anyway, I'm so grateful that we have on this earth, in our plants, in the trees and the shrubs and the flowers, we have molecules and compounds that work cohesively with our bodies to help promote wellness, to help promote emotional wellness, physical wellness, mental wellness, all of it. And so what's cool um, about this plant juice, about essential oils is that these oils really are the immune system modulators for the plants. And these, these oils, they carry the DNA of the plants and now we get to use them in our bodies. And we are so, um, we are so similar to plants in like cell structure and things like that, that they just work so well on our bodies as well. Each oil is made up of hundreds of different chemical constituents. And so one oil can do a number of things. I think that's one of the things I was most amazed with in the beginning of my essential oil journey it was like, you know, I was used to taking like medicines that had one directive, like they, they, their purpose was to do this. It would go in and do that, you know, regardless of whether you need it or not. But these are so innately intelligent and they can do, you know, they can, they can suppress or lift. They can, they can help. Um, I'm thinking about like um, the blues or feeling a little bit anxious. They're kind of different extremes, right? Like one is kind of like heightened and one is more like, Meh. but these oils can help lift or help bring down. Um, and so I, the other thing that's really cool in terms of talking about the immune system is that a lot, and we'll talk about this later, a lot of our immune system is in our gut. We have a lot of uh, bacteria in our gut, but the essential oils, they go after the pathogens and they leave our good bacteria alone. So there is just an innate intelligence in, in essential oils. And I'm very grateful. Okay, so we're gonna briefly, talk about the immune system. So what is it? It's one of our systems and its job is to protect the body from harmful invaders, such as bacteria, viruses, and even cells in our own body, okay, that have kind of gone rogue. Um, so the, it's kind of like the military, it's here to defend, okay, either foreign or domestic enemies, right? So that's its, its main job. And um, pathogens, they can come in from many ways. They can come through our nose, through our eyes, through our mouth, through our skin. And the immune system is really like that first line of defense. One of the things that happens when there is an immune response is inflammation in the body. And that's inflammation is a good response. We want that to happen because it's bringing white blood cells to the area. It's, it's come to defense. The issue is if inflammation lasts a long time that's when it starts to cause um, damage in our bodies. 
We talked, uh, I don't, it wasn't last month, a few months ago about the lymphatic system and it is very closely related to the immune system. They, they need each other. The lymph system um, it, uh, is used to carry materials that are part of the immune system that we need um, to attack whatever whatever's coming up against us. So um, the white cells, we'll call them the night cells, they're like dragon slayers. So they'll go into battle at any sign of trouble. Okay, there's the phagocytes and the lymphocytes. The lymphocytes, you've probably heard of their components. They're made up of B cells, T cells, and natural killer cells. And our innate immune system makes antibodies for each new antigen so that when it comes into contact with it again, it can more easily protect. You guys, our immune systems are amazing. They're better than any we can put in our bodies to create immunity. Natural immunity beats out all the time. Okay, so let's talk about just a few things that we can do before we talk about Young Living products to aid in this. Um, just some things that we can do to help support our immune systems. Sleep is huge. Ask yourself this question. Are you getting seven to eight hours of solid sleep every night? Most of our healing in our body, most of the repair, all of it, most of that happens at night when we're asleep. And so if you're getting, you know, five hours a night, your body isn't getting the repair that it needs to, to be able to be, you know, on its, on its game. Let's talk sun. Okay. So y'all hear vitamin D, you've probably heard vitamin D a lot this year. Um, vitamin D does help support the immune system. The very best source of vitamin D is the sun. So that doesn't mean go out and get sunburned. It means be outside. There's so much goodness in, in being outdoors and um, the sun does help your body to produce vitamin D. Good time to go is midday. You'll hear, you'll hear avoid getting out in the sun midday, but if you can get out midday just for like 15 minutes, that is the best time for vitamin D absorption. And the least amount of clothes that you can have on during that time, the better. Aaron, you're smiling and I'm thinking of you running and you're, this is my brother-in-law. He runs in these itty bitty little shorts during the day. So he is getting top notch vitamin D. All right. Um, reduce stress. So obviously we all have a lot of things coming at us from different directions, right? Depending and depending on the season of life you're in, we have the ebbs and flows, the ups and downs. There's times maybe where you are just good. Like you are just still, and there's probably other times in your life where you feel a higher level of stress. So I think the most important thing is to be aware that you are in a stress situation, to be aware of that, because there are things that you can do to help reduce the stress, obviously essential oils being one of them, um, prayer, meditation, exercise. Um, wow, there's so many things to reduce stress, but you have to be aware of the stress that you're holding to be able to help it. Right. So pay attention. I actually had, <laughs> um, I was going through this, this was probably four or five years ago where I was going through a time in my life where I was feeling anxious a lot. And so I actually put on my um, phone screen to cut, to pop up during the day, just the question, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? And I would take, it would make me stop and it would make me assess how am I feeling? Like, do I feel good or do I feel stressed? And if I felt stressed, I would just take a moment. I would grab an oil. I would, you know, throw it under my nose and just breathe. I would purposefully like relax my shoulders and just do some deep breathing. I would pray. It's hugely important, important to know that you are stressed because our stress is related to our immune system. When we are in high stress, that negatively impacts the immune system. Laughter is another way to reduce stress. Laughter is cool because it releases dopamine. All right. And so dopamine is one of those feel good hormones, which automatically reduces stress. And in this, this in turn helps the immune system to stay strong. Germs. We can't be afraid of germs. Germs are, they've been around for thousands and thousands of years. We come into contact with them. It's okay. Our goal is to support the immune system to be able to handle germs, but coming into contact with germs is what builds the immune system. So don't be afraid of the germs. Um, and then eat a balanced diet. And we'll talk about um, some of the 
foods that are especially good in supporting the immune system towards uh, the end of the class. All right, Aaron, you want to ask that first question? Yes, yes, I do. All right, first question for our giveaways uh, tonight is, what are you already doing to support your immune system? So what's one thing that you're being intentional about? Um, or maybe it's just a habit that you're just used to rocking to support your immune system. Awesome. So throw that in the comments. If you're watching from Facebook, go ahead and throw that in the post as well. Um, I'm looking through really quickly, seeing some of you who've used Thieves. Um, use the Thieves product line, Thieves every day on grandson's feet, um, diffused during your cold symptoms. Um, seeing that a couple of times, that answer. It was one of your daily colognes alongside Valor. Yes, as a teacher, awesome to wear it as a teacher for sure. Um, yeah, thieves for throat support. Very good. All right, so go ahead and finish up throwing your answers about what you're doing for immune system into the chat there and we will move along. Okay. This is where I'm gonna ask you guys to, if you want this list to take a picture, um, I'm not gonna go into detail over all of them. Like I said at the beginning, and a lot of you know this, that there are so many actions of each of these essential oils. And all I looked at as I was prepping for the class was what was their immune support function, but know that there's a ton of others. So Palo Santo um, is a cool one. This one is distilled. Um, from the Palo Santo tree in Ecuador, okay? This was known as um, holy wood. And Palo Santo is good for immune stimulating and it's good for in, uh, healthy inflammation levels in the body. Let me see my notes. So yeah, if you are one who has struggled with a poor diet, um, you know, you're around a lot of pollution, you have a lot of stress, or illness, um, this is one that is going to help to support your immune system. Obviously, we want to work at eliminating some of those triggers, but this is one that's going to help support. Frankincense, this was one of my, it's interesting, and some of you've probably noticed this with the oils, that you have oils that when you first get started, you don't like the smell of them. And as you continue to use them and learn about them and, and understand their benefits, the scent grows on you. And so I did not like frankincense. When we got our starter collection years ago. This was one where I was like, mm, I just do not like the smell of that. I absolutely love, love, love it now. So this is a good one to help reduce the stress response in your body because we know emotions are related to our immune system. Um, but it is just overall good for immune system support. I always say that I think that every cell in our body has like, um, a receptor site for frankincense because frankincense is literally good for everything. If you don't know what to use, use frankincense. And if you are struggling with some immune stuff, frankincense is a good one to use um, for respiratory support. Um, if you're already dealing with low immune system and you've, you've, you've contracted something. Um, and then uh, inflammation. So healthy inflammation response, frankincense is a good one to go to. Mountain savory guys is not one that I use often at all. Um, I think it's an unsung hero in Young Living. So Mountain Savory, it's part of the mint family. It's a very antiseptic oil, uh, supports the immune system. It is an antioxidant. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about antioxidants when we get to clove. Um, but anyway, so yeah, great for supporting the chest and the throat if you're dealing with something, that's Mountain Savory. And I'll say this about all of the oils, you need to, uh, you need to decide for yourself which ones you're diluting and not diluting. Some people have more sensitive skin uh, than other people. And so you might need to start by diluting all of them with a carrier oil, something like a coconut or olive oil um, on your skin before applying so that you don't feel itchy or burning. Um, okay, rosemary. Rosemary is one of the oils that's in the thieves blend. And so once, once we get to the blends, I'll talk a little bit more about thieves and how that name um, was given to this blend, but rosemary is one of the oils in it. And um, I love the smell. It's it's very fresh and invigorating scent. 
super supportive of the immune system. And let's see, uh, supports a healthy inflammatory response as well. And it's also an antioxidant. It creates an unfriendly environment for bacteria and fungus and also supports the respiratory system. All right, lemongrass um, is great for lymphatic support. And while that's not directly the immune system, we know that the immune system and the lymphatic system work hand in hand. So you want the uh, pathways to be working well. So lemongrass is supportive of that. Uh, lemongrass, uh, it promotes healthy cells in general and it strengthens our defense mechanisms against invaders. There is a, a PubMed article that you might want to check out. Also on frankincense, I forgot to mention that. There's PubMed articles on frankincense and on lemongrass that I found very interesting. So if you go to pubmed.gov, you can really just type in the name of an essential oil and it'll pull up any studies that have been done on that oil. All right, so clove, you guys, clove is a powerhouse oil. If you don't have clove, you want to have clove, especially, okay? I mean, for everybody, because we live in the world and we, am, we are bombarded with toxins all of the time. But clove has an off the charts level of antioxidants in it, like in the millions, okay? So um, out of all of the essential oils, it has the most antioxidant power. So what is an antioxidant? An antioxidant is something that renders free radicals, which are kind of like um, um, rogue electrons in the body, it renders them harmless, okay? So it takes something that would go and cause damage in the body and cause aging and cause other things that we don't want. And it, helps, it donates an electron, I think it's an electron. Um, it donates what that, that free radical needs and then it's safe again, it's good, okay? So um, clove, is one that is gonna help a lot with that in the body, okay? So it's, it's uh, really helpful with um, healthy inflammatory responses. What I was gonna say is if you're somebody who's been exposed to like paint um, or harsh chemicals, uh, maybe you were a hairdresser, um, anything where you're around a lot of chemicals or toxins, clove would be an oil that I would put on my feet every night. When you put oils on your feet, or anywhere on your body, it is in and through your body within 20 seconds, okay? One drop of essential oil is able to cover every cell in your body. It's, in, it's insanity to think about that, one drop of essential oil. So this is gonna go in and help clean up messes in, in your body. All right, lemon oil, I just wanna put these two together really quickly and you're gonna have to do your own research on this because I am not allowed to talk about this topic but I want you to go to pub, even if you don't look any of the others up tonight, guys, I want you to look this one up. Type in lemon and geranium oil in pubmed.gov. The first article that comes up is gonna be very interesting for you to read. It's all I'm gonna say about that. And it's all I'm gonna say about lemon and geranium. Just know they support the immune system. All right, cinnamon bark. So lemon also is in um, Thieves Blend, cinnamon bark is in Thieves Blend. And um, what do I have down about cinnamon? Cinnamon is a really hot oil, so be aware of that. That's actually one that I still dilute if I put on my skin, that one in oregano and thyme. I still dilute all three of those. Um, but it supports a strong immune system and it provides a healthy inflammatory response to the body. Melissa oil is another powerhouse oil, um, creates an unhospitable environment for viruses in particular. Um, so it's a good one to have on hand in case you need that. Um, it's a relaxant of the mind too. So once again, as we're thinking about stress, helping to bring stress down, Melissa is a good one for that. Um, good one to just have around during winter months in particular. All right. Um, oregano and thyme, I'm going to kind of talk about them together. Both of these oils are in the supplement that Young Ling put together called Inner Defense. And we'll talk about that a little bit more in detail when we get to the supplements. Um, but these are two powerhouse. I said that clove was a powerhouse. These are two other real powerhouse essential oils that should be in everybody's arsenal. Um, so uh, oregano is another high antioxidant, not as high as clove, but it's an antioxidant. And um, it has thymol in it, which is 
is um, a compound that helps to create an unfriendly environment for both bacteria and viruses. So it's going to be supportive of immune system in, in a lot of ways. That's oregano um, and thyme. And then also these two are in the raindrop technique. If you haven't learned the raindrop technique, um, really cool modality that's amazing for the immune system. You can buy the raindrop kit from Young Living and you can Google it and YouTube it and kind of learn how to do it. But it's one thing that I always do if my kiddos um, are ill, I will do the raindrop technique to help boost support their immune system. So both of those oils, oregano and thyme, are in part of the raindrop uh, technique. So in terms of thyme, thyme is also part of the longevity blend, okay, which I'm going to talk about momentarily. And um, it's a longevity. If you didn't see in our lifestyle group, it's free this month. Say you'll get a free longevity oil if you spend a certain amount. So keep that in mind. Um, there's a great PubMed article on thyme and oregano. So look for that. It's an immune support. Um, it's a respiratory support. It helps to reduce uh, negative emotions and feelings of anxiousness. That's thyme oil. I told you I already said what I was going to say about geranium, supports immune system. Look up lemon and geranium together in PubMed.gov. You're, you're going to love it. All right, Dorado Azul. The cool thing about Dorado Azul is that the founder of our company was the first one to discover Dorado Azul in Ecuador. And so um, love it for that. This is a really good respiratory support oil. Um, it doesn't have, in my opinion, doesn't have the best smell, but we don't always use essential oils just for the smell, do we? Um, so this is Dorado Azul is part of the blend called Inu Power. Uh, it's great for respiratory support and just great for the immune system in general. Northern Lights Black Spruce. This comes from our farm in Canada that is right under the, I always forget how to say it, Aurora Borealis. Is that how you say it? Aurora Borealis? Borealis. Yeah. Borealis. Borealis. And so the idea is that all of the energy from the Northern Lights comes down into the trees and then they're distilling the oil from the trees. So it's a real high frequency essential oil. Oils that are high in frequency like this and like rose and like joy blend, all of the ones that are high frequency are mood elevators, right? And if our moods are elevated, if we're feeling better, we have a reduction in the stress hormone and we have the, the, the dopamine and things like that going up. And so once again, that's going to support the immune system. So that's Northern Lights, Black Spruce. Flora Snubilis is um, one that I don't use much at all, but it is also a good immune support. And it's one that I, um, I want to try to implement a little bit more. All right. Um, Moving on. May I do the, that first giveaway? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. So first giveaway winner is Lexus Chance. So I'm going to post the, um, the link in the chat box um, and you'll just fill that out. And uh, those of you who don't have your last name up um, on, your, on your info, if you're able to put that in there, that'd be awesome. That'll just help me. We're trying to not uh, duplicate winners over and over and over again. So that would be helpful. Um, second question is hey Aaron, would you mind if I get through the blends really quickly before we yep, ask that question? Beautiful. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna breeze through these blends. So thieves, a lot of you know this story during the bubonic plagues in Europe. There were thieves, they were stealing stuff off of the de dead bodies, legend has it, and they were um not getting sick. And so when they were caught in exchange for a lesser sentence, they were asked to give up their secrets for staying well. They were spice traders and they were covering themselves in a specific blend of aromatics that was keeping them well. And so Young, the founder of our company, he found in the archives in London, the recipe that these thieves allegedly used. And he created a similar blend using essential oils. And that's how we got the blend thieves. different oils, several of them up above in the single oils. And this is a purifier. So think about, you know, wanting to purify your house, put this in the diffuser, let it go. Um, Melrose is a very gentle oil to use on children. Obviously it's great for adults too, but I always like to go to this one. 
If um, there is an inflammatory response that I'm wanting to calm down on my kiddo's skin, maybe they fell and cut themselves and it's looking a little fiery. Um, Melrose one that I'll put on that. Um, Ooh, and it reminded me of a really cool testimonial. You guys, if you have not been to an oil underground, um, our next one is coming up October 28th. Put that on your calendar. Real stories of what these oils and supplements and other Young Living products are doing for us. I just thought of a really cool story that I want to I wanna share um, that involves Melrose. All right, so that's Melrose. So once again, it's good for applying topically to areas that need to be calmed down in terms of an inflammatory response. RC stands for respiratory care. So anything respiratory related, you're wanting to care for your respiratory system, RC is a good oil to go to. MU Power is a powerhouse blend of essential oils. I wrote down, I think I wrote down all of the oils that are in it. Um, okay, so this builds the immune system, strengthens your defenses, um, and it has cystus oil in it, which I wish was actually in the single oils up above because that's cystus oil is one that I have been using this year. Um, just, you know, that's all I'll say. Um, frankincense, oregano, Idaho, tansy, cumin, clove, hyssop, Ravensara and mountain sap savory are all in in you power. It's a really strong immune support. Um, Exodus 2, this is cool. Most of the oils in Exodus 2 are biblical oils or oils that were used during biblical times. You can find them talked about in the Bible. Um, and I'll just put this little note in there to look for our oils of the Bible class that will be coming up. Uh, I think we're doing in December, but anyway, we'll be talking about a lot of these oils, but um, Exodus 2, um, there's some researchers that believe that these were the aromatics used by Moses to protect the is Israelites from plague. The oils in it are immune stimulating. They create an unfriendly uh, place for pathogens to exist. And here are some of them that are uh, from the biblical oils, cassia, hyssop, frankincense, spikenard, galbanum, myrrh, um, and it also has cinnamon and calamus in it. All right, Raven Oil, this is a blend. If you got started with the Essential Oils Starter Collection, you have Raven, just like you also have Thieves. Um, but Raven is a respiratory support oil. Um, I feel like it smells predominantly like eucalyptus and wintergreen together. Um, but it's a really nice, powerful respiratory support. Breathe Again, what I love about this one is it comes in a roll-on so you can carry it with you and you know, put it under your nose if you're needing it. Maybe things are blooming outside and you're just needing some extra support for that. Or maybe you're just needing to be able to breathe freely. Breathe Again is a good one to go to for that. And then Sniffleys is from the kids line. There is a kids line of essential oils. Sniffleys E1 for immune system support. I mean, as the name suggests, if your kid is a little sniffly, this is a good one to use. And the kids oils are already diluted. So it makes it really simple to just be able to apply to their skin. And unless they have the most sensitive of skin, because these are pre-diluted, you most likely will not need to dilute anymore. All right, Aaron. All right, question number two. What is one oil you will add to this month's order? So assuming you're on the subscribe to save uh, wellness, wellness box from Young Living, uh, what's one oil you will add to this month's order as you continue to support your immune system? And obviously, if you're not on subscribe to save and have no idea what that is, definitely ask the person who invited you to this call. I, I imagine Andre will share more at the near the end, perhaps about that. So uh, put that in the comments and, and I'll uh, pick a second giveaway winner. Okay, moving on. All right, let's talk supplements really quickly. Guys, you are in the right place. As I, I get so excited as I start looking at like the, the ingredients in some of these supplements, a lot of them um, I take either daily or I take on occasion or I take once or twice a week. Um, but man, we have, as a company, we are a powerhouse when it comes to immune system support supplements. All right. So let's go through this really quickly. Inner defense is just essential oils. Okay. So, um, inner defense is thieves oil as well as oregano and thyme. So you already heard about thieves and you heard me talk about how awesome 
uh, uh, oregano and thyme are for immune support. So inner defense is one of those that I take, I don't take this one daily, but if I feel like I'm, you know, got a little scratchy or body's feeling off, this is one that I'll start taking. It, the oregano and thyme in it, it can upset some people's stomachs. So you want to take it with food, especially with like fatty foods. So some avocado or some almond butter or something like that, that'll help um, keep your stomach, stomach settled uh, as you're taking the inner defense. All right, super C chewables. I am very partial. And I say this every time I talk about our super C supplements, Young Living has two. They have just regular super C, which has higher amounts of C in it. And then they have the super C chewables. I only take the super C chewables because it is the whole food vitamin. The other one is not. Okay. So I believe that taking a whole food vitamin is superior. Even if it's, even if it's a lower amount, it's superior because our bodies know what to do with it. So I love the super C chewable. Um, uh, taking C vitamins helps your body with zinc production or to, to use zinc. Um, Obviously it helps the white blood cells. So it's helping to bolster your white blood cells, which are your fighters for your immune system. And it tastes pretty good. I like taking it every day. This is one that I do take every day, Super C. Okay, Ningxia Red is another supplement that I take every day and I have for almost 14 years. Um, this is one supplement that I would never ever wanna be without. So the story with Ningxia Red um, it comes from the Ningxia red wolfberries, which comes from the Ningxia province um, of China, which is in the, the northern parts of China. Basically, the founder of our company, Gary, he used to travel around finding the blue zones where people lived, easily lived to be 100 years um, or more in good health. And this Ningxia area, okay, which is right by the Himalayan mountains, is one area where people lived to be really old in good health. And so they all said that the Ningxia wolfberry, which was a part of the daily diet, was what was keeping them well, okay? So one of the things about Ningxia is that it is an antioxidant. We already talked about antioxidants helping with free radical damage in your body. So um, Ningxia red is amazing for antioxidant power. So that's one reason to drink it for the immune system. It also has polysaccharides in it and polysaccharides are immune boosting, okay? so. What I learned is that the Ningxia wolfberry has the highest amount of polysaccharides in any known food source. How cool is that? Has the highest amounts of these polysaccharides that are immune boosting in any known food source. Um, it also has natural sources of zinc and it has a really awesome mineral profile. And we'll talk about minerals in just a second here. Okay. Um, and then I put the wolfberries there as well. So you can get just the wolfberry um, and you can add those to whatever, you know, your smoothie, your cereal, the uh, trail mix. Um, if I bake, you know, muffins or something, I'll add a bunch of wolfberries to them. I like eating the wolfberries just by themselves. They're kind of chewy. They're an inter kind of an interesting flavor. Um, I love them, but yeah, so that's the wolfberries. Um, okay. Longevity. So longevity is like, I'll tell you, it's the best antioxidant supplement on the planet. Okay. Because it has clove oil in it and there's nothing that beats clove oil. So, um, uh, once again, our, our longevity is related to our immune system and the body's ability to go after free radicals and render them harmless. Okay. So as the name suggests, longevity helps to promote longevity. All right. Um, if you were part of the, oh, and this is another one that you get free this month, depending on the, the amount that you order. So um, I can't remember what the level is. This one might be at the 190, do that the 190 or 250 level. Um, if you were part of our challenge a couple of months ago, the Younger Games Challenge, it was really fun to see people's before and after pictures using longevity and CBD, um, just seeing the, the shifts in their, their faces and their skin. All right, multigreens, there's so many, I could talk about multigreens for a, a good half hour because there are so many different ingredients in multigreens that do different things. This is one of my other everyday longevity and multigreens are, are so, so far I take super C every day, Ningxia Red every day, longevity and multigreens every day. Multigreens has a bunch of greens in it 
that do all kinds of things. You know that green foods are super powerful for health. Um, I'm only going to talk about two. So it has spirulina in it, which boosts the production of immune cells. Okay. Um, helps to prevent cellular damage. Okay. And it also has Melissa oil in it, which we talked about up, up above. So essential oils, they help the supplements to be more bioavailable bio in our body. They help to get what needs to go into our cells, into our cells, because they carry them across the cell membrane. All right. So remember that the fact that there are essential oils in most of our supplements is a really good thing for actually getting your bang for the buck when you're buying these supplements. All right. Your body's able to use them. All right. So that's multigreens. MU Pro um, is full of immune supporting products. So let me tell you, and, and this one, because it has melatonin in it, which is immune supporting, um, it's also a good one to take at night. If you are having trouble sleeping, this is one that we'll use with our kiddos. Like if we need them to go to bed because we have to get up early or something like that. And we know that they're not going to go to bed easily. And you pro is one that we'll give them at night. Like we just give them each a half They're 12 and nine years old. So we'll give them each just a half tablet of it. And it's a chewable, but this has the wolf berries. In it, okay. So you already know the benefits of wolf berries. This has some specific mushrooms. A lot of the mushrooms are really good for immune system support has that in it. Um, they stimulate the production of white blood cells, B cells, T cells, natural killer cells. Um, it has the immune boosting minerals of zinc and copper and selenium in it. And then, like I said, melatonin. So it's a powerful immune stimulant. This one is great. If you are under the weather and you want to be able to sleep well, it's a good one to take at night because it is going to help you to sleep as well as give you all those good immune supporting products. The other thing that I just learned recently that I didn't realize is if you take um, melatonin during the day when the sun's out and you're active and you're doing things, it's not going to make you sleepy. Um, that only happens when the light goes down, then the melatonin works in that manner. So don't be afraid if you need to take it during the day um, to take it. It'll be okay. All right. Life nine is our product. And so um, what did I write down about this? Okay. So it's 17 billion live cultures in life nine. And it comes from nine beneficial bacteria strains. You guys, most of our immune system is housed in the gut. Okay. So gut health is super important. So um, probiotics help to uh, replenish our gut with the good beneficial bacteria that's help that's going to help to I don't know how to say this and still be compliant. This is, su it's supportive. If you're somebody who has autoimmune stuff going on, I'm not, I'm not saying that it's going to. clean out the, um, the intestines, kind of like scrub the intestines and move things along. The combo of those three is a really good program to do a couple times a year. Okay. Because you want everything to be moving. You want the, the, um, walls of your intestines to be clean so that it, they can absorb nutrients and things like that. Once again, this is a gut health thing. When your gut health is good, that's going to help to promote immune system wellness. So that's the ICP daily. That's a drink guys. They just changed the formula within like the last year or so. It tastes so much better than it used to. This actually tastes good. So the ICP daily is a drink. Comfortone is basically like a stool softener, like a natural stool softener. And essential zymes are enzymes that help to break everything down. Essential zyme, not the essential So this has the enzymes that are going to help break down proteins and fats and carbohydrates um, and help your body to utilize all of the vitamins from your food and then help to move everything out of your system. Okay. So if you're somebody who has 
struggled with constipation, um, some of your best friends are going to be Life 9, Essential Zyme 4, and maybe doing that cleanse, the colon cleanse of the ICP Daily Comfort Tone and Essential Zyme. All right, amino wise, this is like a, a, a post workout drink. It has uh, branch chain amino acids in it. And so it helps with muscle recovery, um, helps with stamina, things like that. But it also is really good for the immune system. Here's why it has vitamin E in it, which is immune supporting and helps to prevent inflammation. It has zinc in it, which is an immune support. It has one glutamine in it, which boosts immune cell action in the gut and prevents inflammation. And then it has lemon and lime oil in it, which are immune supporters. Okay. So that's amino wise. I don't take this every day, but I take it post-workout. So any day that I'm working, working out hard, I will take, I'll, I'll make a drink with the amino wise and my Ningxia red, some ice and water in it. And it's super refreshing after a hard workout. So that's amino wise. Sulfur zyme. Sulfur zyme is basically just sulfur. It's sulfur and Ningxia um, wolfberry. And we already heard about Ningxia wolfberry and the benefits of that. Sulfur zyme, guys, we talked about sulfur zyme for a really long time too, because it does so many things, but I'm just going to talk about um, immune support. So the MSM, which is basically sulfur, which is sulfur, um, it reduces inflammation and stress in the body, supports the immune system. It stimulates the production of glutathione in the body, which is part of a healthy immune system. You may have even heard talk about glutathione this past year. Um, so MSM is one thing that helps to bolster the production of that in the body. Um, MSM can also reduce, this is important. So remember we were with nature's ultra CBD, we were talking about if you have some autoimmune stuff going, uh, nature's ultra might be one that you want to try for support. Same thing with MSM, same thing with sulfurzyme. If you have some autoimmune stuff going on in your body, um, this the MSM can help, um, your body to react appropriately because with autoimmune stuff, you, your immune system is attacking your own tissues and things like that. This helps your body to respond appropriately. Okay. So it's another one that I would try. Um, all right. So let's talk about, okay. Thieves cough drops, self-explanatory, great for soothing the throat has the thieves oil in them. Mineral essence guys, I've been learning a ton about minerals and mineral balancing and the importance of minerals this year. I, I, I heard Gary young for years talk about how important minerals were because they really are the foundation and that every issue that we deal with any chronic illness, anything like that can be boiled down to some mineral deficiencies that we have. And guys, our food is deplete of minerals. It's really sad. The condition of our soil, things like that today versus 50 to hundred years ago, um, for a lot of reasons, but we won't get into that tonight, but it's important to supplement with minerals. It really is because we need minerals to help vitamins to work in our body. There's a, there's correlation between all of that. And one of the most important ones is magnesium. Um, I take a magnesium supplement that, that young living doesn't have like um, a magnesium supplement. They do have the, the nighttime one, like the kids line magnesium, but I do take a magnesium supplement. That's not from young living. So if you want that, I'm happy to, I don't make anything on it, but I'm happy to send you over the information on that separately. This is a young living class. So I'm not going to talk about it, but anyways, that's magnesium is super important. Mineral essence does have a little magnesium in it. So it's going to be supportive. Um, the cool thing about mineral essence is that it has 60 trace minerals in it. So all of these different minerals that we need in our bodies, mineral essence does not taste fantastic. So a lot of people will hide it like in some orange juice or some other kind of juice and just kind of like take it down, add a little bit of Ningxia and, you know, take it like a shot really fast. Um, so however you need to do it to get those minerals in your body, go for it. But I'm just warning you, it's not a great, not a great flavor, but important minerals are hugely important. And then the last one, golden turmeric. This is one I don't take it every day, but since it came out, I probably take it twice a week just to get um, some of that turmeric in. It tastes really good. I like adding it to tea. Um, I have the sleek tea, so I'll make like a hot sleek tea and I'll add um, the little scoop of, of golden turmeric in it. I forget, it's a half, I think it's a half teaspoon that you put in. Um, anyway, so turmeric is 
awesome for immune support, awesome for helping to, you know, one of the things that our immune system does is fight unhealthy cells in our own body, right? Not just invaders from outside, but our own body's unhealthy cells. So turmeric is one of those that's really good um, at, at doing that as well. All right, so that's a lot of different things. I'll tell you again, what do I take daily? I daily, for my immune system, I take Super C Chewable, Ningxia Red, Longevity, Multigreens, uh, Life 9, Supplement. Those are my everydays. Those are my everydays. All right, so Aaron. All right, so winner number two. First off is, I texted myself, <laughs> winner number two, Chris Taft. Chris Taft, you're the winner number two. And so I'll put the link or find that link in the comments, but I'll do the link one more time. Um, and then question number three is, what is one supplement that will be a next purchase? As you're thinking about immune system, you know, Audrey has been dro dropped us in on a lot of different supplements. What's one that you're excited to dive into if you haven't tried it yet? Um, yeah. Okay. Man, we are running out of time. Okay. I'm not gonna go over this. I am not your DIY girl, but we throw this in for those of you who like the DIY stuff and like to make your own blends. So I feel like Young Living has already put blends together that are really powerful. So I'm just going to use the Emmy Power or the Thieves by itself or the Raven by itself. But if you are like, oh, I want to make stuff. There you go. Take a screenshot real quick. Okay, moving on. All right. And I, just because of time, I don't, I can't go over all of these, but I'll tell you all spinach is also super high in C um, almonds have vitamin E which are anti-inflammatory same with sunflower seeds avocado um, is high in A and B and C um, turmeric, we already talked about green tea has great immune supporting action. Um, papaya is really good at, uh, as an anti-inflammatory kiwi is high in C. Um, if you look over on the right side, the lobster mussels and, um, oysters are all really high for, um, zinc. So it's best to get your zinc if you can from natural food sources. Um, so there you go. There's, there's some of that, but if you want to take a screenshot just to bolster your immune system through food, these are some great choices. A couple quick testimonials. Um, my seven-year-old daughter was put in a cast for a fractured ankle about a week later, the had continuously gotten worse. After another doctor visit, we found out if that it had broken internally and was severely infected. To support her immune system for the infection, I covered the area with a few drops of Melrose, put thieves, can away oregano on the bottoms of her hurt foot and gave her four ounces of Ningxia Red. The next day, her infection was significantly better. And with another, within another week of continued support, her body was able to fully recover. That's not really compliant, but okay, we'll go with it. And then um, <laughs> the second one, both my daughters get chronic itchy red skin patches on their face and body to support their bodies. I make the following solution, two drops of frankincense, one drop of lavender, two drops of Australian blue, one drop of peppermint and two ounces of V6 massage oil. I apply that twice a day as needed. So many good oils for skin support and for healthy inflammation responses. All right. Here's just a couple ideas um, of how to reach the promo levels with Young Living. So when you order hundred PV, um, from Young Living, you get free shipping. So anytime you do a 100 PV order, it's free shipping, or you can choose the free shipping. Um, and then at the, the next level to get free products, guys, there's 10 free products available this month with Young Living. If you go to our lifestyle group, I just posted about it this morning. It tells you all of the 10 oil, oils and supplements. Um, but here's an example of a 190 PV promo. Those, those products would come 
automatically if you order at this level. And then the best way to order is through um, subscribe to save. So here's the perks of it. You get to change your order and shipping date each month. You can cancel at any time. So you're not locked into anything. You don't need to be scared of that. There's ex exclusive product promotions every month. So while just by ordering 190 PV, you'd get some of the free products, you would get extra free products if that order was on subscribe to save, okay? Um, so loyalty gifts at 360, 50 PV a month. So anything that gets you to 50 PV, you're going to earn 10% back for the first three months. After the first three months, it's going to go up to 20%. And then after two years, it goes up to 25%. So if you order a minimum of 50 PV monthly through subscribe to save, you're going to get those extra savings on top of the 24% that you will already be getting as um, a customer with the 24% with the savings. Okay. So that's cool, I think. Um, I'm just going to show you this really quickly. What do we have in terms of time? Two minutes. Okay, good. So um, we know, I used to think this was so crazy, but um, one of the things that I have learned in my journey in natural wellness is just the connection between our emotions and our physical health. And so um, there's books and, and, and um, online resources where you can find some of these connections. But um, when we talk about infections, some of the probable causes that can be a part of it um, are things like irritation and anger and annoyance, or lack of joy flowing, bitterness, things like that. And so we can choose a new thought pattern, okay? Um, instead of feeling the irritation and the anger and whatever, we can say, okay, yeah, I feel that. I'm choosing to let it go. And I'm going to choose peace. I'm going to choose harmony. Okay, and then same thing with the Byron viral infections. I lovingly allow joy to flow freely in my life. I love me. Our words are powerful. Our thoughts are powerful. So let's not ignore them. Let's be aware of changing and shifting what needs to be changed. Here's one for leukemia, a kind of cancer, um, probable cause, brutally killing inspiration, thinking what's the use. So a new thought pattern would be, I move beyond past limitations into the freedom of the now it's safe to be me. And then some verses um, that have to do with health and an immune system. Lord, my God, I call to you for help and you healed me. Psalms 32. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. That's Matthew eleven twenty eight. 28. But I will restore you to health and heal your wounds, declares the Lord. Jeremiah 30, 17. And a cheerful heart is good medicine, but a crushed spirit dries up the bones. Proverbs 17, 22. So just meditating on some of those good words is hugely important in our healing journeys. Okay, for those of you who may be brand new and wanting to get started, here's how you do it, okay? You can head to youngliving.com. You wanna make sure that you have the um, member number of the person who is enrolling you. If you spend 100 PV on your first order, <laughs> that's not spelled correctly, it will unlock the 24% discount. If you enroll and subscribe and save, it will also unlock the 24% discount. So you can do either or to unlock that savings. Um, the best value still, I believe, is the Essential Oils Premium Starter Kit for $165. It gives you 12 really versatile oils, several of the oils that we talked about tonight. And then it gives you some other goodies as well as a diffuser so that you can diffuse the oils in your home. This also qualifies you for free shipping. All right, this is how you can connect with us. If you want to take a screenshot of that, Aaron, you want to do yep. the winner of that last one? Yeah, Andre, it's such a great class. Uh, winner number three is Bernie Gutierrez. Uh, so congrats to you. If you'll fill out the form in the uh, chat box, that would be awesome. And our last question is, what is one takeaway tonight? What's one thing you're walking away with? um that you're excited about that you're you know some, some piece of inspiration could be a product piece could be an oil piece could just be a wellness um wellness like energy that you're excited about um so that'll be our final question i'll check those out and uh um, in the meantime i'm gonna also shut down facebook thanks to those of you who joined on facebook or watched this on recording and if you caught this on youtube thanks for stopping by and be sure to reach out to whoever invited you to look at this video. 
um, you know, check in with them, you know, ask, ask more questions, um, you know, hop on the Young Living website and explore around and, you know, find, find the answers you're looking for. Uh, at the end of the day, it's about solutions, you know, at the end of the day, it's about solutions. I think that's what I, I heard you sharing tonight was a lot of different tips and tools and right at our fingertips, right? Right mm -hmm. at our fingertips. So thanks for, thanks for rocking it, Andrea. Um, all right, I'll, I'll pick a fourth winner while you get the PowerPoint up and rocking for yeah, the we're second. Gonna, we're gonna move on for those of